Everyone, it's Izzy from Lizzie's Brother Gems. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing uh, Manic Monday, um, my whips in progress. So last weekend I was off, not this weekend that just happened. The weekend before, um, there was a Zoom call for the um, little, can't think right now, the miniatures. So I ran out of glue, but I managed to make this. And then I put together um, the bottom half of the base of the house of the pool, the one that I was working with with Tyler. Um, kind of upset because the way Tyler put all the stuff back in the thing, it was a little bit wrinkled. So some of the paper got a little bit wrinkled on the wall, but I'm hoping after I start putting in everything, it will like, hide itself you know what I mean um this floor kind of went a little bit crooked but once the furniture is on maybe we won't be able to tell <laughs> we're gonna hope um I don't think I put the wiring properly underneath for the lighting that could be an issue um I should have prepared more better but I did not um this is just my first go of um, a house so if it doesn't work out perfectly the first time around then I know where to improve on the next one that Billy bought me that I really want to spend a lot of time on so that's what I did there now I started um, plastic canvassing this is as far as I've gotten so far um, I haven't worked on it really since the last time I did it, um, I did manage to order more needles that came from Amazon. I'm hoping that they are bigger. I haven't opened it yet. I'm hoping that they are bigger so that I can get this thread in. I'm finding it very hard to thread the needle. I find it very hard to thread the needle in the one that they gave me with the kit. Oh, see, so these ones have really big, really big um, holes. This will work a lot better for me. Um, it, even if I go a little bit smaller let's see those are really big what about this one see it goes through anything to have a bigger hole to get that thread in one of these should work so it can go a little bit quicker and maybe I can have one needle per color and then I don't have to keep on going back and forth. That would be a plus too. So I did purchase that for this. I think it's coming out very, very good so far. So that is that. I might work on it a little bit some more this weekend because I have this weekend off. So first one up is Flirty Friday. This is as far as I've gotten on Flirty Friday. I'm just going to adjust the camera just so to see if you can see Flirty Friday. Um, the detail is coming out very, very good on the arm. This part's not done, 
I got some of it done. Then I stopped and I moved on to probably my Lizzie. But that's as far as I've gotten on um, Birdie Friday, which will be work on it some more on Friday for you guys to see. Um, this is the cats. As you can see, I've gotten pretty far on the cats. i gotten to here on the cats. It's looking really good. I think I messed up one of the colors, but it's so bright and colorful. I don't think anybody's going to notice that I messed up on a color. But as you can see, it's turning out super, super good as well. So that is the cat. This one now is super, super big. I don't know how I'm going to show you this one, but this is my mystery diamond painting. So I got all of this end done to here. Looks like it's water or something. And then I got all this part over here done as well. Looks like buildings. I can't go and try to go a long way for you to see it this way. But it's super, super hard. Um, and then over here, we got some buildings. It's super, super long. Um, gonna probably try to work on a couple more sections on the weekend as well. I have so many plans for the weekend and not enough time for sure. So that is that one. And now, last but not least, how much do I have done of my Lizzie? This is as far as I've gotten so far. Working on this section right here. Um, I'm probably going to continue on finishing this section today and well I'm going to try to finish this row and then I'm going to put it away and I'm going to work on the cats for a little bit. Um, I'll probably bring it back for tomorrow's live and I'll bring it up for tomorrow's live. Um, depending if anybody's coming live with me. If nobody's coming live with me, then I might just work on a different project during the live, like my cats or something. But you know how much diamond painting actually gets done on a live. Not too, too much. So there you go. There's my Lizzie. It's coming out super, super good. Um, no popping drills. There's a little bit of gapping, but with the light off, as you can see, you can't tell, but when I have the light pad on, it looks like a hot mess. <laughs> but without the light pad, it's turning out to be amazing. Super excited. Can't wait to see that one done. I'm going to bring it up in close, and we're going to talk about bullet journal this week. See you soon. back I gotta figure out this desk everything's on a flipping slant I don't understand I don't understand this at all <sighs> the wheels the legs adjust but I just can't get it to the right height for this uh... um, area so my bullet journal, I'm seeming to use a lot of washi tape only because I can't find my ruler and I can make clear lines going across with the dots. <laughs> so that's why I've been using a lot of washi tape lately. Um, so important dates this month are Lizzie Long is going on from June to July 1st. Billy's birthday is on June 8th. So remember everybody to wish Billy a happy birthday on Tuesday. So. Um, I got Manic Monday today. I got my live tomorrow, which is Billy's birthday. I got a whip and chat on Tuesday. I have an unboxing and then I have Flurry Friday and the shout outs. And then hopefully on the weekend, I can work on some of my projects. I got so much time and little time to do it. 
Hopefully I can get it all done. I know this has been a hot minute since I've done a Manic Monday and I am so sorry for that. And I'm gonna try to make myself more productive. My priorities are to get my videos out and I know I've been slacking on that. I think it's just the heat in the summer and then all the noise and everything that goes on in this house now is so fine. I'm finding it so much harder to find time to videotape like right now they're out there talking and hopefully you guys can't hear any of it but with that said that is it for my bullet journal this week i hope you guys enjoyed it um tia says she wants to learn about bullet journaling um basically i just watch videos and when i first started out i kind of copied some of the things that they did i haven't really gone back to any of these and i should because I really liked some of these, like this one I really like. Um, maybe I'll go back to the pens with the markers. I've been kind of going a different route. But um, some of these I just made up myself and I created it as I went along. Um, the thing about bullet journaling is you put your own creativity into it. Um, um, whatever you feel and I'm not like the greatest artist in the world by any means but um, <laughs> Alyssa did this one <laughs> and uh, I really like the arrow kind of look I like the arrow see with the markers it's a little bit different of a kind of feel to it. Um, some of them I've messed up obviously around here. It's a learning curve. This is my first bullet journal. So it's a learning curve for sure on what to do and how to do it. Um, I really like the cloud kind of theme. That's one of my favorites. The Christmas tree was a pretty cool idea for December. Um, just kind of go with the flow. I know I've missed a couple of weeks here and there, but you can really see when I was on top of my game. And then you can see when I started drifting off a little bit in May. I drifted off and now I'm in June. So yeah, last week I didn't have one. So this is my first June week. <sighs> That's the thing about bullet journals. Um, you can skip the week and nobody's gonna even know. Um, if you have a planner, you're obviously gonna know because that page will be blank. Um, I don't know. I'm going to finish this bullet journal till I get to the end maybe and then maybe I'll try doing uh, planning with the planner um, or maybe I'll try next year um, instead of the bullet journal and see how that goes. I kind of like this one because I get to write and be creative and draw and stuff. Well, I haven't been drawing lately. I've been just using a lot of washi tape. So maybe next week I'll do a little bit more drawing. But with that said, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And I will check you guys all out uh, tomorrow in my live. So go over there and uh, watch me. Okay? Because I'd really like to see you. Till next time, everyone. Take care. Bye. Well, folks, that's it for today's video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. And if you like, please subscribe to my channel. I be super tickle pink. And remember to hit that notification bell and it will remind you whenever I load up a video. And till next time, take care, everyone. Bye. <laughs>